today on the channel. We've got one of my most anticipated Marvel Legends releases of 2024. We're looking at Cable on the way I got it figured. The way I got it figured. What's up, figure fans? We I got it figured back with another Marvel Legends series review. This time we got Cable. Marvel vs. Capcom version. Why am I calling him the Marvel vs. Capcom version? Well, this is the version of Cable that appears in Marvel vs. Capcom 2. Right down to the colors. Um, and, you know, I don't know what, what other check boxes they were trying to hit. Because they could have made him with a deeper blue like he appeared in the comic. But uh, they didn't. They made him like straight up and down Marvel vs. Capcom 2 Cable. As you can see here, there's a Sprite of Cable and matches up perfectly. There's some artwork of Cable, matches up perfectly. So, you know, Cable. Yeah, I'm like everybody else in the world that read Marvel Comics all his life. You know, Cable's a pretty fan favorite character. Fan favorite character of mine. Um, he's, you know, rubbed elbows with X-Men, with the Avengers. Pretty much everybody at this point. And he did have a nice long running series with Cable. I think, I think his series turned into Cable and Deadpool. Um, but, you know, he's been around a while, first debuted in New Mutants number 87, way back, I think, in like 1988 or 89, and, uh, you know, I've been following him on and off ever since, uh, New Mutants 87, so, of all the versions of Cable, this is probably my favorite, not that not that he has really any bad versions, particularly or whatever, but you know, it definitely helps that he has a Marvel vs. Capcom 2 connection there. And uh, can't wait to get this guy out. So, first thing we're going to do before we get him out is look at the packaging, talk about the packaging. Acknowledge that he's a part of the Zabu build a figure wave. Get him out and do the stuff that we normally do. Do some comparisons. Do some posing. Get you out of here with some final thoughts. We're starting with Cable's package. Got Cable in here with some reused weapons. Weapons reused by him, even. Couple of extra hands and a Zabu build a figure leg. Marvel's cable Marvel on top Legend series. Some artwork and cable that doesn't match the figure that's in there. This is artwork of cable, but it's not the artwork of this cable. I've seen where a lot of people have been complaining that he has, you know, his arms aren't sleeved or whatever. That's the reason why they're not is because this is not the cable that's in the box. So people doing all these mods, I, I think it's a lack of understanding of what this cable represents. But it's not their fault that the Marvel Legends team selected the wrong picture for cable. So you've got uh, your little blurb here about cable cable travels back through time from a dystopian future to help the x-men as an enhanced telekinetic mutant you got your build a figure wave for zabu superior iron man it's iron man he generally does not come with a build a figure piece Marvel's Black Winter, Wolfsbane, Kazar, 
Red Widow, Icarus, and of course Cable. And each of them come with a builder figure part. Cable coming with a leg, that leg right there. So there you go. So we're going to get old Cable out and see what we're dealing with. All right, so we've got Cable out of the package with his accessories. And it comes with, you know, four extra accessories. Got your two guns and your two trigger hands. And then you got uh, the hands that are on them. He's got kind of a gripping hand and a fist. Gives you some options. Got your uh, gun that's come with figures before. Came with cable. Definitely came with crossbones. Same here. Got your two trigger hands to be able to hold the guns. And you've got your Zabu build a figure leg. I do want to complete this wave, but Jory's still out on how soon that's going to happen. Um, but I do like the Zabu figure. I like the Kazar figure. Kazar, I've seen him get some complaints, but I don't, you know, know what people are complaining about. I actually think he looks great. Uh, but you know, we'll get more get more into that later uh, when I have Kazar in hand. We'll take a look at Cable. He's got a nice, uh, you know, five o'clock shadow. Great detail on the face. Of course, he's got his his energy eye and his hairdo, which is consistent with this outfit. Got his robotic arm. Uh, fully fully pinless, except here. His this arm has a pin, so I guess this is a reused arm. I wonder if it's reused off the other cable. Pretty big arm. As for articulation, you got your key pose. Pose out there. No drop down leg. I swivel. And kick out to about there. Pretty decent knee. Pretty decent ab crunch. Like how they did that, they made these false straps for that. Go back pretty far. You can lift up pretty high. Down pretty low. Obviously 360 degree there. Got a little bit of head waggle. Decent bicep cut on the pin less arm. Pretty normal bicep cut on the pinned arm. Only three hundred sixty. Okay. Takes it back only to about there. Ankle pivot. Pretty decent articulation there on cable. Got 
Again, this is a gun we've seen before. Of course, these bracelets are removable. I would have liked if he had came with a rifle for the uh, for the Viper beam. That's the one to pose with a gun pretty easily. Do his uh, punch from Marvel vs. Capcom, which is basically he pulls out a pistol. Pretty cool. Definitely, uh, can do most of his Marvel versus Capcom poses. I think he's like doing like this, like he's like a super, like doing like kind of a long kick. Of course, he's got an extra gun in his hand. That's nice. Really like that. Yeah, pose is nice. Looks great. You know, it's it's pretty much cable I wanted. I don't know about you guys, but I'm super happy with this guy. This is great. Then, I'm going to save it for the comparison. But, the old cable, which I do have on hand here, we don't need it for the review, comes with this gun. And I wish. Uh, I wish he did, but he doesn't, alas. Hyper Viper Beam Big Honkin Viper Beam uh, Hyper Viper Beam rather air hyper viper beam because he kind of like floats through the air with it. He's got the ground one. This is like the perfect gun for that. But yeah, there you go. Cable, posing, Viper Viper Beam. Now time for some comparisons. All right, let's do some quick comparisons. So the first comparison we'll do is Cable with Cable. So this is the old Marvel Legends Cable. Plastic style. This one seems like it's just a tad bit bigger, but it might really be more or less because of the, you know, all the super 90s OG cable pads. Next, we'll bring in. The guy that, came, that Deadpool really teamed up with, who Cable teamed up with Deadpool, way more than Wolverine, even though Wolverine's getting a movie with him. Of 
Uh, Wade Wilson. I got not too long ago on the channel. I did the video on the channel rather. What you got? Nate Gray, the sort of alternate cable from the Age of Apocalypse universe, even though we could argue he's not exactly cable, but he's kind of cable. Jada Tories Ryu from Street Fighter. In 97 Wolverine. X Men ninety seven Cyclops. If you look at these, these are sort of like rosters that you can make on Marvel vs. Capcom two. New Age of Heroes. But the one I think I like the best with uh, with Cable was. Dial. That's a soda toys gal. And Captain America. So there you go. There's some comparisons for you. I'm gonna move on to final thoughts. Final thoughts on Marvel Legends, Zabu, Build-A-Figure, Wave, Cable. Yeah, it's going to be a 10 for me, dog. This is the Cable that I've always wanted. If not, if not the original Cable, then this would definitely be number two or number one in the original Cable. You get all uh, the feels from the video game. You get the comic book feels. You get all of it. Uh, and it's a great figure. Poses well, stands well. Just looks great. Glad to have him in my collection. Yeah, I got a figure rank 10 all day long. This might even be, you know, Marvel Legends figure of the year. We'll see how it shakes out. You know, we're only about halfway through. So, I'm going to leave it there. If you uh, like the content, please like and subscribe. Check out my other videos. We've got a lot of Marvel Legends videos, a lot of G.I. Joe Classified, Transformers. We're, we're all over the place here. And uh, we'd like to have you along for the ride. Till next time, everybody stay safe. I'll see you on the next video. Peace. The way I got it figured.